nice to meet you all. This is not my first time seeing you guys. I've seen some of you guys already before, so I feel so familiar. I feel so honored to be here again. My name is Sylvia Kim, and I work for a YouTube company, as you already know. Um, it's called Korean Bros. And I have my personal YouTube channel, Sylvia Kim, and also um, a Korean channel called Shoun, but I don't operate that anymore. I just do it. I, I did it for fun, like two years ago, three years ago, but I don't operate it anymore. So that's why I'm going to use that as the material for um, showing my, uh, what do you call that, AdSense, my YouTube AdSense and like the views and analysis and everything of it. Okay, so I've got a lot of questions and like you guys were telling, telling me that you want to know how the YouTube algor algorithm is working and how to be like popular and trendy on YouTube. So yeah, that was actually everyone's question, even for YouTubers, even for like YouTube companies. I'm, I'm being really, really honest. Like nobody knows actually 100% how it works, but I can give you like really um, good tips how to be like more like um, more popular and how to be on full page for other people, how to be like popping up for other people's recommendation channel. Okay, so let me briefly explain myself again. I am Sylvia and uh, I am operating YouTube channels and I'm doing a lot of things like vlog. I usually do vlog and I deal with a lot of different culture differences and I edit a lot of videos for my company as well. So yeah, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah, so do you guys remember our manager? Like he used to do, he, he did a TikTok video with me and it got like so many views that day. Like it got like, okay, let me check. It got like more than 5,000 views. Yeah, so it was really fun. It was a really fun lecture last time. I have a really good memory with you guys. Okay, let me check. It was, it was five, okay, wait. It was 5,794. So I did a TikTok wipe, wipe with my manager and it got a lot of views. Okay, so, so today I'll be talking about how the YouTube algorithm works and also like recommendations, how to be more like um, popping up for other people's, people's channel. Okay, so first of all, let's say, um, let's review our channel name. So I've got your channel names. Okay, first, Ida, Cassie Cute, um, Katrina, Yum Style, it's James Jim here, Mirdit, Mirdit Vlog, Bettina, Ariandi, Arianti. Sorry, I can't read all of these, but you know, make sure that you make your channel names very, very normal. You know what I mean? Like it has to be catchy. So like if you make it like really, really complicated, people can't really understand. And also people, modern people, I myself as well, like watch a lot of YouTube videos, but that doesn't mean that I put, like I do a lot of like, I mean, I watch a lot of videos. What kind of YouTube videos do you guys watch? I watch a lot. Yeah, seriously, a lot. But that doesn't mean I have, I just have so much time. Everyone's time is very valuable. So make sure that you have to have a catchy name and title. Thumbnails are very important. And we should think about ourselves. Like, first of all, what am I to people? What am I? Like, first of all, um, I always think I want to, I want to do YouTube. I want to be trending. I want to be popular. Then why should I be popular? Why people should watch me? So that's always my thoughts. And that's always my, um, that's, there's always my philosophy about it. 
So whenever I think about myself, I put my channel name as my name so I can be myself in the video and showing my daily life in Korea, like reality. Like I'm not faking everything. I want to be myself. So that's why I put my, put my name on it. Also title, like you put titles, like according to what you do. But like I've gone through a lot of your YouTube um, videos actually. Um, yeah. So I want to go through all of them again, like one by one. And I got um, three people that I'll be consulting in depth later on. But first of all, I want to give you like personal opinion one by one as well for today. So let me share this screen. Okay, wait. Wait. I want to share this screen. Share. Okay. Do you guys see my screen too? Like, do you see me and screen too? Oh, that's perfect. Okay, perfect. <laughs> okay, so I want to talk about how, how analyze your YouTube channel and this one is the one. This one is the one. Do you see this? Yeah? Okay. Okay, so this is actually my YouTube channel three years ago, <laughs> which is quite embarrassing again. But okay, so this is my channel back then. I don't do it anymore. I don't have operate anymore. What I'm doing is this one now. I'm operating this one, but uh, what I do, I used to do this YouTube channel for Koreans. So basically I targeted two different targets. One, this one is for Koreans. This is for Koreans. And Sylvia Kim right now is for, for foreigners, especially English speaking people. And also a lot of Filipino people, a lot of Filipino people and a lot of Americans and some Koreans. So you should know that um, what kind of people that are, what kind of people are watching you, what kind of people actually like um, you are targeting. So, like if you want to do like oh, I want to do anybody, no, you should target one country or like English speaking countries, Korea, like very specific countries that you want to target. Okay, so title. Um, title and thumbnail I'll be talking about later as well. And as I already said before, what characteristics do you have? What personalities do you want to show? What values do you want to share with? You know, so this one, okay, I'll be clicking on it, even though it's kind of, okay, I don't want to, <laughs> but okay, let's see. Which one should I see? Um, okay, this one. So. I used to go to Sungmyung Women's University. That's my school in um, 2000, 2014, 15, 16, 17. Okay, so this one is about school festival. My school festival vlog. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be clicking on it. Whoa, nice, nice editing. I like it. <laughs> it was a very bad camera that day that back time but still like you know, it doesn't look that shitty <laughs> thank god oh yeah that that's me so this is oh my god okay. so i'm showing my video like my friend how i eat the day it's a festival day. i'm showing the vibe right? and the like yeah like a lot of a lot of music, sound effects, but what you want this. So I put the title of this as a um, Sungming Women's University Festival Day and Night. Day and Night. So I'm, I'm be showing 
nighttime as well. When I was like filming it and editing, editing this, what I thought is that I want to show Korean people my daily life, but a festival vlog, you know, like it's very, very, you have to make it very sure what I want to do, you know, not just like, oh, randomly, I just want to show my vlog. That's like people's time is very valuable as yours as well, right? So like you have to target and put the uh put the importance important content on it so if you see this koreans don't really subscribe that much but if like compared to my subscribers there are more like views right now right especially this one is um 140k if you think about this why this one got so viral this one has a lot of information this one has a lot of information so i put i don't usually put like english subtitles like this but i did it before coming here to show you guys how to have an interview for korean universities so i literally show like everything how i got into um, this school and which school i got like accepted how i did for interviews and what the professors told me what i did for like entrance exams and those kind of things. So this one is informative and like very um, beneficial for people who are trying to get into like schools, right? And this one, like um, I used to work for Disney. I was in America for six months and there was a Disney internship uh, and I did like a lot of different things in Disney. So I said, I got into Disney. I got a Disney internship at that 40k. I didn't expect it at that time, but people like it when they discover something new, something they're interested, they're familiar with Disney, right? And they're, they want to know what she's going to talk about because she got into like uh, Disney already, right? So what I want to talk about is that people need to know something. People need to discover something. You don't need to be always informative, but people need to be like sharing something, some feelings. So if you um, see this one, okay, living as a Korean girl and my campus life, and this one is my trip with my mom. So if you see this, this means like I'm sharing my childhood memories as, as a Korean girl. So people want to know about that if you're interested in Korean life. And this one, if you're interested in like how her mom is like, like what is she like? Do they look alike? Those kind of things. If you're like, if you want to know about my mom, also this is a trip to Japan. If you want to plan um, trips in Japan, you know, they'll probably click on it. And this one, if you're interested in college, my college especially, there are so many people who want to do like exchange, exchange student. So like uh, my school has been like, accepting a lot of like exchange students. And if you want to know about their real life, you know, I would click on it if I were the person who's going to apply for that, you know? So uh, make sure that you want to give something, some vibe, feelings and information, information and some different kind of contents like I should do, not everybody do. Um, okay, so this one is just, I'm still doing my vlogs, but I want to go on my analysis. Okay, let's go on YouTube studio. This is how you analyze your own channel because YouTube analyzes more than, way more than you think. It's very, very, um, um, sophisticated. Okay, let's go on to my own YouTube channel studio. Okay, I put the, um, I make it, I make it, I made it like, I don't make money with this. I made it open it, I, I opened it, but I didn't like make it um, like profit. I don't do anything about this. So I just, 
want to show this. I don't have so many videos here, but let's go into analytics. If you go into this, okay, you can see how many views you got in last 28 days. And especially like how, how much you can reach people, how much engagement was involved. And what about your audience and revenue? Everything has to be like very specific in here. What I wanna, what I wanna show you is that here, so I wanna see this video's analytics, okay? Let's see analytics here. And since I haven't, um, since I haven't used this account for a long time, I just want to see something really, really long time. Like, let's see, 2019. Okay, so 2019. This is about like how got how I got into this university and how I did an interview, right? And I talked about different schools as well, how I did everything with my professor and blah, blah, blah. So this one, if you see this, um, this is January, March, May. If you see this, September, October, this is very high, this period, right? And there's a reason for this because uh, September, October, November is the time for entrance exam in Korea. And this is the time you get interviews. So people, you can see this, like you can see how, how many people are, are watching and how did they get in this source? If you see this, there are a lot of YouTube search. YouTube search means you actually literally typed on it. Like you wrote down uh, how to get into school, you know, how to do college interviews. And I got a lot of views from this, like almost 50%. That's like, people actually need to know about this video, right? And channel pages, it just like pops up. And browse features, when you browse, like scroll through all the things, it just um, recommends you. And suggested video is the recommendation, like suggested popping up for you. So if you see this, like, um, you can see it very specifically if you go into analytics like last 48 minutes last 60 minutes nobody watched it <laughs> last 60 minutes but anyways so you can go on to your analytics and see why people watched it and how many people watched it and do they watch it for a long time okay so audience retention this is very important so when you make a video you uploaded it and you see the reaction right and when you just unload it, that 48 hours are very important. That 48 hours, that decides everything. So you unloaded everything and then people start to watch here, right? 97% watch it. And then they drop out from here, you know? So you see, um, they're dropping out here and then here again, they're dropping out again. So they exit my video from that moment. And if you see that, I'll be talking about different things or like kind of lose, becomes lose, you know? So you can just check out what time they're exiting your video, on which point am I giving them like boring feelings, you know? It's kind of hurting, it's kind of hurtful sometimes if you actually like notice it, but you really need to know why it's, it, it's been dis decreasing like at this moment, you know? And also, um, within those 48 hours, everything is decided by your like and subscribe and comment, which means your audience engagement. So how to be trending, how to be suggestive for other people is that you have to have a lot of interaction with the audience. Okay, let's say I made this video, I made a vlog for today, and then I uploaded this. And as other YouTubers said, constantly do it, then you're gonna succeed. No, actually, people are not watching it. Why? People are not watching it that much. It should be like 1,000, 
2000 and growing up and sometimes I need to be trending, sometimes I need to be popping up for others, other people's suggestions, suggestive videos, but why am I not popping up, you know? The reason why is that people don't have so much interaction in your video. Okay, so within those 48 hours, um, why, the reason why people like subscribe, uh, people like to re recommend, to make them like, they constantly say like, like and subscribe and comment down below. There's a reason for this because if, it, if they just watched it and exit like this, and then no comment or no like or anything, then YouTube algorithm doesn't suggest your video afterwards. You know, you can't be on the algorithm. You need to make them curious. You need to interact them. You need to have their attention. You need to get their interests. You know what I mean? So this kind of video is an, uh, it's kind of, this one is exceptional because it's too much information. But let's see something like, um, so let's see this one, the last one, analytics. Okay, so this one has channel pages, 61.5 percentage. So this one means people didn't really research Research, like search one is like 26%. This means people are interested in ownership, this ownership itself, but channel pages, they got suggested from my video, right? So if you think about it, what kind of contents can I give them more vibes and feelings? Yeah, that's more important. Okay, so let's see. Um, monetization as well, what we are really interested. This one, I didn't set up for AdSense because I'm not doing it. Fix it in AdSense, you go on to AdSense. How many people are like uh, monet monetizing in your, in your channel? Okay, this one, <laughs> this one I need to verify. I'm not gonna do it right now, but how many people are monetized? I wanna know. So analytics, so people are asking me like, do you get money from it? Do you like, do like, do you actually get paid from it? And if you want to know about this, there's a really good web page. Um, it's called Social Blade. You can go onto this Social Blade website and then if you just make it, if you just type on it, like if you just write down the channel name, let's say, okay, let's say Sylvia Kim. Click on it, then you can see everything. Guys, you can see everything. I'm not kidding. Okay, select channel. Yeah, see, they even graded my score. I'm a B, <laughs> so I'm a B YouTuber. There's an A, A plus, like something B, B plus, B minus, C, D, E, you know? Um, you see, uploads 26, subscribers 169K, views, country, you know, it's kind of creepy. You can see everything from here, you know? Um, this is total subscribers, yeah. And then total video weekly. I don't know if this monthly earnings are correct. I don't know if it's updated or not because I haven't checked it either. But you can see how much percentage they uh, they got, they increased. You know, I'm just like increasing day by day, <laughs> like just like this. You know, I'll be hitting 170k soon. Yay! Yeah, check it out on here so you can have more information. You don't need to ask the, the like, you know, the, what do you call, the people. Like, you can just go on to, like, you can just check it out by yourself. Let's say um, BuzzFeed. BuzzFeed. You see? There are a lot of things. 
let's check out YouTube. Wait, this is YouTube. This is Twitter. Wow. Hey, wow. Okay, it's a YouTube company, right? So you can see minus, even minus, oh my God, this is so painful. Yeah, you can see everything from here. Yeah. Future projections, details, statistics. This is so hurtful, oh my God. As a YouTuber, this is so heartbreaking, oh my God. Okay, details, statistics, live follower count. Yeah, you can check it out, everything here. And also, I want to show you another website, which is called Video IQ. Video IQ. Yes, Social Blade and Video IQ. You can check it out here as well, but I prefer, I personally prefer Social Blade because I don't know if it's working for that now, now but it used to pop up if you just download Social Blade. It just pops up. It just analyzes every contents. So like, for example, um, let's say youtube.com. Let's say... Oh. Okay, let's say I want to know what do they what they do here, right? How how much percentage people are watching and how many how much benefit how much profit they're making? Then when when I just click on it, it just popped up here. Like how much percentage? Like is it going up, down? Like social blade analytics here. It used to be like that, but nowadays I don't know why it's not working. So if you download it, you can use it, use that function as well. Okay, let's do more analytics on my YouTube channel. <laughs> uh, the reason why I'm not doing it with Sylvia Kim is too much privacy. <laughs> too much privacy. I, I actually want to show you guys, but this has like so much, like it has a lot of spam as well and like profits related. You know, so I can show this one as well, but it's just too much privacy. So I just decided to use this one because I'm not using it anymore. And this actually interesting because if you see this, if you just see the views only, like this one. Okay, let's go into this one. This one has very little views. If you see why, this one is the, the is my friend's birthday party, and I said, "How how is it to have a foreign foreign friend's birthday party?" And like, you see this? This is very low. Why? Because people don't know your friend. <laughs> people don't know if it's my birth, like if it's my birthday or my friend's birthday. You know, you have to make it relatable. Something like, if I do it again, I'll probably do like, mm, I got drunk. <laughs> then people will see, like, you know, people will see, oh, ah, like, you you did this in your vlog, here and that. Like, oh, you have, like, friends, this and that, you know? Okay, so let me go on to, yeah. So you can do a lot of analytics, use a lot of this. Oh, yeah, oh, I forgot to tell you about this. Traffic sources are important. You can check out traffic sources, you know, by time and geography. So this one, I targeted Korean people, right? So it has a lot of Korean people. But Philippines, I think they came from Sylvia Kim. <laughs> they just clicked on it from Sylvia Kim. Australia, Canada. Viewer age, you can check that your viewer age as well. That time I posted a lot of like university related and my like Disney internship. So younger generation is more is more likely to watch my videos like later on, right? But Sylvia Kim, if you go onto it, my viewer age is like 25 to 34. And viewer gender, 
wow, this is very equal. <laughs> very equal. But Soviet team, 80% male. <laughs> I don't know why. And date. So you can just analyze and analyze, oh, this one has a lot of women because I talked about women's university probably. And date date you can check out your date revenue source um pre pre premium revenue is not that much but usually just yeah it's just from the adsense advertisements probably if you see this this is every youtuber's pain not subscriber not subscriber not subscribed people are more likely to watch my videos yeah it's always like this always usually always like this and subscription source uh, youtube watch web page so if you see this there's a graphics here and youtube channel youtube search as always other youtube channel oh i want to see what other youtube channel it usually pops up what other youtube channels and links they uh, follow through well this one i think I need to operate this channel as well so I can traffic what they're watching from me. Playlist. Also make sure that you have playlists. You can check your playlist. The reason why some people just make it like, okay, this my my YouTube channel right now is not a good is not a good um, example. Look at this. This is very bad, guys. You have to have sections. You have to have sections. For example, I talked about universities and Disney, right? Then you have to categorize, okay, Disney related, Disney internship section, and then university sections, and mokbang or something. So you can customize your channel, like, and categorize what you're doing. Oh, it shows differently than Sylvia Kim. Yeah, layout. Okay, so you can change your layout and feature different things. Okay, featured video is the thing that pops up in your channel, like as soon as they click on your channel. So let's say I wanna start with this one and this one, okay? Then from now on, it's gonna be your main video. Yeah, and also, Make sure that you have sections, playlist. There are a lot of people actually just um, play and do something else, like play your video and then shower, play your video and cook. You know, there are so many people. So make sure that you have playlists so they, even though you, they're watching it, watching your video, and after that, it just doesn't jump out to other channel. You're gonna seize that moment. You're gonna make them keep watching your channel. So playlists have good information. Like playlist has a good function to uh, to keep them. Okay, this is the things that I did a long time ago when I was in university. So I kept it in playlist, but I want to make a new playlist like Disney internship. And then you're gonna put you're gonna put more videos in here description this is my Disney experience Disney experience as an ICP ICP means international cast member ICP cast member program uh, in 2017 okay save save and then you're gonna put this, um, in all the information here in this section. Then they're gonna be jumping up, like uh, they're gonna watch more videos from you and they're gonna just keep watching your videos. Yeah, you have to be more like creepy in some ways, in a, in a bad way, I should say. Like make them, just keep them, you know, keep them. Okay, so. Uh, I want to recommend some YouTube channels about analytics. I want to I wanna recommend 
YouTube. Our YouTube channel, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, so here I want to recommend Catherine. Catherine Men. She is a very good YouTuber who analyze, an, analyzes YouTube so well. Like, if you go into this, she makes really good videos, guys. Um, how to get started. Like, she literally just talks about YouTube on YouTube, <laughs> which is kind of interesting. Yeah, so, like, how can we be trending how can you be suggested for other people you can have a lot of information up here and i highly recommend this channel because she has the same information that i did like um audience interaction and subscriber like you should know what subscribers like think and what they want to know about you am i fun am i chilling like Am I chill, like, so people can watch my interior and, like, uh, my, like, wake up and till the, till, till the night vlog, you know? Those kind of people. People have different vibes. I'm, like, hyper person, right? So people want to know what I do in my daily life. How much energy do I have? And I know myself what I can do. If I do just, like, hello today. I'll be talking about, then nobody will watch me. <laughs> I know that. If I just film anything that I have around me, nobody will watch me. So half the point, like, keep yourself updated about yourself. Like, uh, what do I do? What do people want to know about me? What do I, what am I good at more than people? Yeah. Okay. So this is my recommendation. Okay. So I've got 40 minutes left. Before I jump into um, personal counseling, I want to go every single person's channel. So let's go find it out. Okay, I'll skip those three people that I'll be consulting personally. And other people, let's watch your um, channel. Okay, do you see it? Do you guys can see it? Okay. All right. Okay, so when I saw this one, you guys are, you guys have really good talent about like animation and Photoshop, especially. You can, you can, you guys have like so many colorful things on thumbnail in general. But if you see this, I don't know what you're trying to do. Korea strengths. Talk Talk Korea, like Talk Talk Korea. I don't know anything about Talk Talk Korea, right? So you have to make it more like wider. You know what I mean? Um, if this is mokbang, mokbang, like people use vocabularies that people might know. Yeah, this is so cute. Like the layout. Oh my god, I love this layout on the thumbnail. Yeah, and I love this kind of like simple thumbnail. This is so good. Yeah, this makes sense. This makes sense. I can see what you're trying to do. You know what I mean? That's so cute. And this one, it's jam here. Yo, Ginan Jamia. Oh my god, so cute. Okay, so this one, actually, I love this title. How I cleaned my skin. But like, I want you to more focus. If I did it, I would definitely focus on my acne more, like before and after. And I've got some, um, I've, 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 I know one uh, YouTuber who got really trending from that thumbnail. So before and after only. If you're focusing on like visual contents, like makeup or like skincare, those kind of things, I wouldn't put any um, subtitles on it. I wouldn't put any like words on it and good job for doing like the main video popping up here yeah oh if you're doing unboxing or how or like some type of like chill videos really like peaceful videos 
make sure that you design it very well. Okay, Cecil is my friend. Cecil does it really well. I wanna show you guys. If you're doing it like beauty YouTuber, Cecil, if you see it, you can just tell, oh, she's gonna be like very chill and peaceful in the video. You can tell, you, can, you should make it like obvious. You see, you see the color? This is how you design your thumbnail. Like, because she's very chill and calm person and she wants to know, like she wants to share a lot of things like, oh my, um, like interior design and like summer clothing, you know? This is a good example. And yeah, especially like, okay, let's see, my channel too. My channel, Sylvia Kim. If you see my channel, you can see the energy. Like so hyped. <laughs> you see this? This one is a very serious topic, but you can see like my facial expression, you know? You have to have your own characteristics on the thumbnail. So people can see it right on the spot. At three seconds, it decides three seconds. Okay, so next one. Okay, this one. I like it, it's so cute. Oh my God. Oh my God, this is so cute. Like actually, so if you think about it, if it's male and who don't really like cute things, probably male, I am so sure you don't have so many male subscribers. Like I'm so sure if you see it, but if you make really good contents, it can be different. Gosh, then I, I love this font. It's so cute. <laughs> yeah. And you guys are really good at like designing and everything, like putting subtitles. I was actually really impressed. I love this kind of thumbnail. Like it shows what you're trying to do in Taekwondo. Like I'm not recommending too much information and on your thumbnail. And this one especially, I don't know who's reacting. Oh, your dad, your dad is reacting. So my dad reacting. So put your, then I would probably put like my dad on the thumbnail because like K-pop and then like it shows the vibe. This is so cute. Like I actually like your style of thumbnail. This is so cute. And constantly make it like uh, your own vibe. Like, I don't know if you're chill or hyped in this thumbnails, you know? This is so cute. Anyways, okay, let's go on to the next one. Bettina. Okay. Bettina, hi, are you? You're the person here. I've seen your videos. Actually, I liked it. I like this one. You uh, compared Hungarian. And this is so interesting for Hungarian people, probably. Then I'll make it more like versus. You know what I mean? This is like very chill, like, hello. Like, if I, if I want to do it, I'll probably put like this and this versus you know <laughs> yeah make it more like emphasizing more exciting so people can see like oh they're gonna compare this oh they're gonna have culture differences here and also vlog like are you mad <laughs> you're really pretty you're really pretty even like i'm watching you here you're really pretty you can emphasize more features of your better angles and like better features of yourself, right? And using really good high quality pictures are highly recommended as well. I usually don't use any pictures from my phone. I usually go for digital camera. So it can be more like uh, outstanding and high quality. Okay, next one. 
This one is. Oh, where did it go? Arianti. Did a good job putting it here. I think it's targeting not Koreans or English speaking uh, countries, people, what I can see. So if you targeted one country, be very, very specific, like very, very, very specific if you already decided who you're going to target. So this is a lot of words, like and also the design. Design is like, whoa, and then black, pink. I would probably put black, pink's um, images, like pretty black, pink features. And then like, whoa, my face, you know? Whoa, like, what? Like this kind of thumbnail. And um. What I want to recommend is don't use too much like parentheses and parentheses like because people don't really focus on those kind of things, you know? Like if it's just like, okay, let's say this ownership, this ownership, people are interested in this ownership itself. But for example, um, I can't understand from here, but if you put some other information that is other than the topic, then it can distract attract other uh, people's attention. Like, so don't put too much information in it. And I love this design. Yeah. A little bit less, less picture or like focusing on your face would be really nice. I can't really go through all the contents I want to talk about like how you edit and those kind of things, but I did it before in different workshops. So I'll just like um, see only on film. Okay. okay, this one. I like this one. Okay, this is what I meant. But that's there's too much going on in the back. I can't read. People can't read it. People can't really recognize all the things in the back. But this one was a really good. <laughs> really good move okay this is actually good you see you know who's operating this one and two days ago um i want you to i recommend you to change phones so it can look a little fancier and maybe try to use some like high quality pictures of yourself yeah if you see this so all of a sudden this one is an animation right and this one is a different person, different things. So have some constancy. Unless it's like mukbang, if you put different things, people don't watch it. Unless like, oh, I touched BTS, then you can put BTS on the thumbnail. But if you want to be the main character of your uh, YouTube channel, don't put other people or don't put anything else. Keep emphasizing yourself and keep emphasizing what you're trying to do. You know what I mean? Okay, so next one. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, next one is. Yeah, this one I watched it last time as well. I love the, I love the animation here. It's so cute, wow. Oh, you're doing covers. Can I watch it? Yeah. Oh, whoa. This is very high quality. I love this song. Yeah. You did it? You did your production? This is actually really interesting. Yeah. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. But like... Oh, uh, okay. Let's see. Oh, you copied the the company channel, right? Company channel. This is actually really good. But like, who are you targeting? Are you targeting Koreans? Are you targeting Filipinos? Yeah, this one is very high quality. 
but like I want you to have like different sessions. Uh, Gaming videos have more targeting. I'm targeting as much as possible. Like you have to have a country. That's why. This one doesn't look like you're targeting any specific audience. This one is good, but like Korean hairstyle, Korean like music cover and like reaction. There's so many things going on, like trip. Like if you're, yeah, if you're trying to do different things, it's good, it's good. But like try to focus on one content first. If you're gonna do like target foreigners who are interested in Korea, like who are trying to visit Korea, then we log in like how my actual life is to the people who are trying to come to Korea. But like this one doesn't attract everyone's attention, also specific audience. That's why it's not going up that well, even though it's a really high quality. And the thumbnails are really good, like very high quality. Yeah, you know how to edit, like you just had the, yeah, had the uh, titles back in there. And that's really good. Yeah, you need to have an audience, like specific audience. Keep doing it, keep going up. That's good. Also, next one. Okay. Okay. Did I click on it? I'm so confused. What's going on? I click on it. Okay, is it this one? Yeah, I think it's this one. Okay. Okay, so you put um subtitles Korean. The title is Korean. But I feel like you can target is it Mexico? Yeah. Mexican people better, right? You can attract Mexican people's attraction. Like Mexican people can be more interested in this kind of things. Um, title like K-dance, K-fashion, K-education, I don't recommend this because people don't really care. Like this just takes up a lot of space. And the first sentence, the first wording will be really important for catching people's attention. But this one, I don't really think so. You can categorize it as sessions, as I said before, just like this. Oh, so, is a but actually, Hanyejong is a really good art school in Korea. So, if you want to be like attract, attract, um, if you want to attract like Korean people's attention, like people really like art school people in Korea, you can do it all in Korean and put English subtitles, then both will watch it. Korean people who are interested in foreigners and like who are like very um, like surprised with their Korean ability, then do subtitles and everything. Oh, the title in Korean and the full subtitles in English. Then your friends can watch it too. But this kind of videos, I really want to make your face better on the thumbnail, and then title. Um, I, I like this title actually. Foreigner who, who studies uh, Korean music in art school. But I think I can make it more like powerful because you go to art school. Maybe like what I think about art school, like in your picture. So people can see like, you're a foreigner, oh, and who is actually attending the, uh, that high school, you know? That'll be, more, um, that'll be more impact on your video. And I like your videos too, yeah. But since you haven't uploaded you, about yourself, I think it's gonna be a little late, uh, like slow, not late, slow. But you can just keep posting about your school, target Koreans and put subtitles in English. And target your school use your school your school is very good and and then next one
Okay. Oh, this one doesn't have that many videos. Yeah. I think you should constantly make videos. And then if it gets like more than 10, you'll see yourself. Oh, I want to make those kind of contents, you know? Yeah. So keep going. Just keep going. And then next one. Keep going. Hello. Okay. Navigating the rise. Okay, this looks, okay, you can tell. This looks like not a personal YouTube channel. You know, it, more like um company channel or like magazine or something, you know? So I wanted to do film, but other do TV more. Is it is it one person channel? I want to know. Yeah, so if it's one person channel, if you want to do vlog and those kind of things, this is not a good example for the thumbnails. You should be the character. You should be the personality. You should be the person who wants to talk about, right? Yeah. And this is very neat. It looks like, um, yeah, it's an education channel, right? Yeah. Okay. And you got like 1,000 people. And putting popular uploads here, it's really good. It's really good because popular uploads, that means people are interested in the same concepts and same, like similar, not the same, but similar types of videos. So you can have more um, like interaction with people, better interaction with people. Okay. Next one. Next one. Hey, come on. Okay. And this one. Like, I'm, oh, you know how to edit. You know how to, like, on my room TV. This is good. This is a catchy name. On my room. But why all my room? Like, it looks like you're going to talk about interior design, to be honest. So, like, this one is very neat. You know how to do it. But, like, make the design more, like, catchy and, like, have some impact on it. You're more your face and, like, attracting, like, attractive titles. It's a one, the Harlem of Seoul. Like self quarantine assistance in Korea. This is more likely to be an education channel as well. Yeah, right? And next one, I think I can't go through all the things, but I'll just go right over a little bit more. A little more. Um, I've got five, six, seven, seven channels more. Is it okay to go over? Oh, I saw this one. I saw this one. Yeah, this is so cute. Oh my God, are you a koala or like cat? I love the design. I love the, the color. I think you can have like more like featured face on yourself. Yeah, there are not many chat oh, videos about this. Okay, next one. Hi, Hanguk. Hi, Hanguk. Mm, yeah, it doesn't look like a one person's channel, right? It's like just like um taking out someone's video, right? So yeah, that's why I love South Korea. If it's targeting foreigners, I'll probably put it as why I love Korea, why you should visit Korea, and my face, and food back there. You know what I mean? Yeah. More catchy. More impact. And next one. Sorry, guys, it takes more time. It's hard to go over everyone's channel. Whoa. 
안녕하세요. 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 Use your use your own language as well if you're targeting your nationality people. Yeah, this is good. I love the design too. Yep. And then Yeah, I am thinking the same. Like for from this, I don't know what what I'm watching, like what I'm gonna be watching soon if I click on it. So this is like, it's so random. So you have to make their focus on it. Like very simple, simple is better. I'll, if you see this, choose one that attracts your mind. Maybe probably this, but you don't know what it is. And you know Tokuki, it looks good. And obviously it has the best views among this channel, right? Among these videos. So make it eye-catching. That's more important on the thumbnail. Okay. Fangirl in Mexico. I like the name. Fangirl in Mexico. Oh, wow. Fangirl for what? Oh, yes. I love this kind of... If you have your own culture, comparing culture is good for... Uh, catching people's attention. So, comparing Mexican and Korean fans. I'll probably put pictures of Korean fans and Mexican fans and the verses. You know? Like, ah, like, ah, like, you know? <laughs> Those kind of different, like, different vibes on the thumbnail. Yeah. I like the font, fangirl, and the name, title. Okay, Asia TV, Gen TV. Okay, I went through, I, I, I watched this last time as well, right? I watched this. Actually, this one, this title, uh, like, uh, this name of the channel, like, it's kind of difficult to people understand, to people understand. And I love, I love the same design. And similar concept. I think you're gonna reach ten thousand soon. Yeah. K reaction. So if I watch this, oh, ad. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. okay. Bienvenido, chicos, a su canal. Let's go. You are very, very, very high quality, but it doesn't show that high quality on the thumbnail. You know what I mean? the real contents are more high quality. So if you wanna show that, you have to make a little bit different in design, maybe like more simple, simple and more sophisticated design will be so much better and more helpful. But you're gonna grow, I think you're gonna grow, yeah. Also, next one is, Beautiful by Baekhyun. Can I play this? Oh, cool. so you're you're doing a cover. So I think you wanna make sure that it's a cover. And this is a phone thumbnail, I can tell. Make it more high quality. People's time is very, very important as your time is so important too. So make them click on your thumbnail. Yeah? Yeah, it's a be beautiful voice. Actually, I was really, this is, you know, more high quality when it actually clicked on it. But people won't click on it if, if it looks like not high quality, you know? So, being a YouTuber is kind of hard in this kind of 
aspect because you have to be always eye-catching. Always think about uh, what the title will be like, what I put on the thumbnail, what kind of facial expression should I use, you know? This kind of things too, yeah. This is not for influencers, I can tell, right? This is not an influencer's channel. You should make your identity more valuable in your channel so it can be more outstanding. Na Indo. Na Indo Saram Korea. But this one is very, I don't know. This is understandable for Koreans. Na Indo Saram means I am Korean. Uh, I am Indonesian. But you can, I think you should target Indonesians. But if you use this, Indonesians won't probably understand. And this is too long, right? Yeah, so make it a little simpler. Yeah, I like this kind of thumbnail better than this. Better than this. I like this one. Yeah, I like this one here. And next one. Last one, guys, last one. You waited for it so long. Last one. Okay. Oh, you did a signature on here? Oh, no, no. Everything ma magical, uh, magical. I thought it was a signature. <laughs> yeah, I think it's better to put your face. Yeah. Or like, if you want to make it simple, just use a different font. Different font and make it simple. Dynamite. Oh, dynamite. This is too much, like too much, like different things going on. Too many things going on, right? Make it simple like this. Yeah, this, I like it. Oh, and the design is so cute. I think you can be a um, good, like chill video um, influencer. This is actually really cool. Yeah. Um, design is very important. Make it simpler. There's too many words. Yeah, I actually really like, like it. You know, when you um, turn pages and like people, the drawing like changes, like moves. I think you can make really good those kind of contents. You know? People have different talents and different vibes. So. Okay, so that's it for reviewing everyone's channel. What I want to emphasize is that, okay, let's wrap up. Let's talk about different things. Oh my God, <laughs> there are so many, too many channels. Okay, let's wrap up. So, so first, what I talked about is the channel name. Channel name, is it catchy? Is it eye-catching again? And title and thumbnail, make it high quality, make it simple, no parentheses, unless it's like really, really obvious, right? Third, think about your own characters and your value. Uh, what do people like about me? What should I share about? What do people watch? And if you already put yourself out there, check out on the analytics. Oh, people watch this video better. Why did they watch it better? Why do they like this one better? You know, it's very, sometimes it's very hurtful, even for myself, because I'm making videos like really with so much effort and time. And sometimes, even with really less effort, it goes viral. <laughs> I made this video with so much effort. I made this video with less effort, and this one goes viral. Why? There's always a reason, you know? The reason why is that, like, this one features me more, or, like, people like this vibe more, or, like, this one was more simple and was more eye-catching. Yeah, you have to take that, you know, you have to be like, okay, even though I put so much time and effort, I'm fine, <laughs> I'm okay. This went viral, then I need to find out the features from out this one, you know. I need to constantly check on myself and characteristics of this video and think about myself too, you know. And make it simple and make it relatable for everybody, you know. if you focus on one nationality, then think about what you can do for them. 
what you can show for them, you know? And I, I dealt with YouTube Studio. Uh, you can see a lot of things in here and make sure that you constantly check your traffic sources, genders, and age engagement. Make sure that people engage in your video within 48 hours so they can communicate better in your channel, more comments. So the tip for me to make people's comment a lot is that I constantly ask questions in my video. Even though I'm talking to myself, like, you know, in the video, I constantly ask questions like, like, did you ever felt, did you ever feel this? You know, I felt this one. And did you feel this? Then you automatically want to comment. Oh my God, I felt this too, Sylvia, you know? Constantly interact with people and um, like and subscribe are really good engagement. Being trending is very, very, very hard because you have to have all of those within like 24 hours, 48 hours. But if you become like really, really popular, I've, I've made some videos that were trending for my YouTube company channel. But that's very, very hard. But if you come like constantly just put efforts for yourself and what kind of values do I do you have? And you can find it out. And also thumbnail, guys, thumbnail. Thumbnail is very important. As I already said. And I went through all of your channel, right? Yeah. So keep it in mind that visual contents are like should be eye-catching for other people because our time is valuable. Okay. So that's it for today. Oh, it went over 14 minutes yeah thank you for today and it's not going to be always like so successful even though you put so much effort and time but it's okay put yourself out there a lot constantly you should know your value yeah share your characters with other people thank you for today yeah and don't forget to do the survey satisfaction sales survey if you're not satisfied, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm totally fine. If you give me more feedbacks, if I come out again with this workshop, yeah, I'm gonna listen to it. Yeah, I'll be constantly putting efforts. Five stars for Sylvia managers. <laughs> Thank you. My manager didn't wipe with me today. Sadly, his right over there, I think he escaped from me because I'm going to make him like do something really weird. But anyways, <laughs> yeah, he's not in here right now. He's right there. So thank you guys. And uh, I'll be consulting three people that are selected. I didn't select those people, actually. Um, the program selected. And congratulations for being selected. And I'm going to be giving you more advice and like personal aspects and giving you like more energy and like, I really wish I could do it more like one by one, but I genuinely think you guys have like your own power. Like you have the influence on other people's like, you know, on other people's like um, thoughts and, you know, YouTube. So yeah, that's it for today. Bye-bye. You can exit. Bye. Hope you have a great day or night or anything. It's actually very, very light in here, like 3 p.m. I'm going to be eating after this. <laughs> yeah, bye. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi. Oh, nice my God. To meet you. I'm so happy to meet <laughs> you right now. I'm so happy you're hearing me right now. <laughs> yeah. So could you introduce yourself too? Like uh yeah, sure. Yeah. Oh, hi. <laughs> My name is Gila. Gila. Gida. Gida. Yes, it's kind of weird. Uh -huh. <laughs> um <laughs> I'm from Ecuador, so mm -hmm. I speak Spanish. Um yeah, I'm I'm twenty one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so like uh, let me go on to your channel. Can you give me oh, yeah. your channel? It's my name, Gila. Like, it's really um, here, uh, here. I already I already went there, right? 
You too. Yeah, I think so. Okay, do you see what I'm seeing too? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Jiva. Yeah, I like it. Yes. People can hear us? How can people comment right now in the group chat? Yeah, that's my channel. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> this is a really good clickbait. You did a really good yeah. job. <laughs> Okay, let me watch it first. Lo vieron en la miniatura y sí, tengo algo que contarles, tengo algo que revelarles. Primero que nada, me sorprende. Is it real or just a big thing? Ya lo sabían, no sé cómo se dieron cuenta, no sé en qué foto tal vez vieron esto, en qué video. Pero sí, algunos de ustedes ya se dieron cuenta, entonces fue como que, ok, ya es momento. Ustedes saben que como que cuando hay alguien especial, uno quiere decírselo a todo el mundo. Y sí me ponía triste, la verdad, que porque... Did you have this, sir? I stopped. Oh, oh sorry, a... it was my mistake. It's okay, no. Mundo de los idols, no podía revelarlo así al público. Hoy estoy super feliz porque le pedimos permiso, obviamente a su compañía, y nos dijeron que no había ningún problema. No había problema con revelarlo. Podía salir en el video y podía, bueno, yo sacar este video luego, que es lo que estoy haciendo ahorita. Quiero presentarles. A mi novio, boyfriend. <laughs> you are a really good creator. Algo super curioso que Thank you. That was um, on my peak boredom of quarantine. <laughs> <laughs> but this one has a problem. There are going to be like a lot of exiting people because it's yeah. very long. And this was it's very really eye catching. Long. Very eye catching. And the title. Is very like very powerful, yeah. but it doesn't start with that impact. So I want you to have some highlight on your video. Like mm -hmm. sometimes I do the talk in front of the camera, and sometimes I do like really important information, and then like I do like big reactions. Right? It's important oh, to yes. catch these people like constantly and make them watch the video, not exit it then you have to have the highlight in the first section so people can tell oh she's gonna do it one day like one time later later on it's gonna pop off so i, I recommend you to have like some you highlights oh you already put it <laughs> but like a little longer and have more yeah. yeah like more specific information so people will be like oh when is she gonna say that when is she gonna say that you know for yes as a yeah, viewer yeah. right now, I just said, I just waited uh, until no here, yeah, yeah. but I'm like, like when, when? Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. You're, so you're right. Yes. Don't make people like wait for it because people are really impatient. So like mm. you should always think people can watch different things other than me. So yeah, just catch their attention and then keep it. People may exit maybe three minutes later, but that first moment, they shouldn't exit. So that's your goal to make them mm. like stay in there and like, oh, she is interesting. M make that time very short and then be eye-catching within okay. like a short time. Okay. Yeah. And then your like, actually thumbnails are really good. Like really good. Yeah. Thank and I you. Love that's one this. thing I, I struggle with. Thumbnails? I never know what to put. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's always everyone's struggle, though. Everyone. <laughs> I love this kind of content, and if I love it, and like other people love it, like a lot of people will see it. You know, twenty-four mm, like yeah. cultural differences always. Let culture differences always like. Um, okay, so I'll be talking until like 35. Is it okay? 3.35? So it's not 3.35 for you, probably. Like 10 more mm, minutes. Kind of. Yeah, 10 okay. more minutes. Yeah. So this one, this is really good. Like diet, 
Korean food vlog, but I think you are really weak in vlog. Yeah. Like the views? Oh uh, no, it's good. Actually, um, I had so never this one is done that. Lower than the other ones, right? Mm, yes. That was my it? application for Cambridge. <laughs> oh, can you hear me? No. Mm. Wait. Oh, do you hear me? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, yo, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Okay. I think it's the earphones. Yes. So, like, I think, okay, K Influencer, nobody know what K Influencer Academy is, right? You don't need to put anything like this, or if, unless you really want to. Mm. So, like, people don't know about Korean at K Influencer Academy. Like, if I were you, I'll probably put the title like I learned how to be an influencer oh <laughs> or, like um, trying to be an influencer 24 hours you know <laughs> those kind of things oh, okay. yeah, yeah yeah make it relatable okay, like, really? because yeah so people can be like oh she's gonna do something about like being an influencer but you don't need to show like Influencer Academy, like Korean ad, those kind of things. And also this, this kind of thumbnail is kind of distracting. Yeah. Like, I don't know what you're eating exactly. Like, your face is on there, like, out there, but, like, on mukbang, usually, mukbang influencers have their food and their face really clearly. But this one is really not clear, right? Oh, Easy, yes. Yeah, yeah, so I would rather make it like this better, but more on food. Anyway, okay. Mm, yes. If I see it like oh you don't have any more. So if you see mokbang YouTube. If you do really good mokbang people. Even though you're not a mukbang influencer, probably like, <laughs> look, look at this, look at this. You can yeah. see it, like very, very like powerful. You see? Yeah, it catches your eye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the point. Like, I don't know what you're eating, <laughs> to be honest here. Yeah, yeah, you're right. But the coloring is really good. I think you're really good at like coloring and design. And if you see this, it's really good color. Like oh. you blurred this out, and then you put like foams in it. This yes. is so eye catching. Yeah. And let's see your popular modes. Um. So people are interested in the the first it? one. Is, uh, um, diet, right? Diet. Yes. Mm -hmm. People are really interested in diet. Keep doing that. Keep doing that. Like do like 24 hour challenge or like for a day or just like um sometimes make it short every day film yourself like short and then make it as a one month something you know oh that's yeah. a cool idea yeah, yeah yeah so keep doing it about like diet and like workout sessions too you know okay. sometimes uh i use diet was trending a long time that, ago. That's the first video about. Oh. Yes. I was going to suggest that if you didn't do it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, yeah. I think, I, I think you can do, you can do really well. Like, you already have, like, a lot of subscribers. And make them, like, curious about your life. You know? Oh. You always have the, man, you can, you can do some type of makeup challenge as well because you're really pretty so like you you should use your features too like um not like this this one is good oh. because it, it shows but um uh, okay let's see i'll show you korean bros 
Okay. Um, would it be okay if I, I later, I don't know if we, if, we, if we have time, but I wanted to show you the YouTube studio screen. Oh, you want to? We got only yeah. three minutes though. <laughs> Yeah, okay. you can, you can. I'll, I'll go through it. You see, like this, like skincare routine. If it's like this, you know, we are holding our like oh, cosmetics, okay. and before and after, this got really viral. I edited this before and after, like very, very obvious. I think I saw that video. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was so viral. Yeah. So okay, okay. Let's go into your um studio, YouTube studio. Okay. Do you have male or female more? Do I have what? Male subscribers or female sub viewers more? I I have female viewers. Um, yeah, because you do it like hip hop. And... I think that. I yeah. think you can. Mm hmm Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah, let me go to my, um, okay, YouTube studio. Mm -hmm. Because I actually like, I'm, I am almost never in here because I don't, I don't know how to use it. But today I learned a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, so can you go on analytics? Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, I'm asking. Oh, approve. Okay. Okay. Is it me? I think you can move my screen now. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so if you see this. Okay, let's see. Your video. And then. Oh, you got. <laughs> yeah, you have to be really careful about like K-pop and those kind of things. And also, if you don't want to be cut off with this, you constantly mm -hmm. have to pause your video. Like, it oh. doesn't have that much sound. Like, click and then, oh, from now, like, I'm just going to be talking and then pause and then pick. But it's oh, very, that's... very strict. K-pop is very strict. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know that. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Which one? Okay. Let's see this. This is diet, right? Okay, let's see. Uh, Jungkook's, Jungkook's workout. Mm, I'll work out. Okay, analytics. So if you see this, browse features, people didn't look it up usually. They just br browse and they just look through and they found your channel. They oh, found okay. your video. Like, and also, okay. you reach, actually, you reach a lot. You see this? Yes. But people didn't click on it that much, you know, compared to mm -hmm. your impression. So you oh. have to make it more like powerful, you know? Um, and source traffic, as I already saw it, and engagement. People exit here, from here. And you check it out, which part was it, right? And people, almost mm -hmm. half of it just exited here. Yes. <laughs> And here again, right? Mm, yes. Oh, oh no no no! That people got in here, exited. <laughs> sorry sorry. The low part is exiting. The low part is exiting. So people are exiting like this and this. But actually, it has a really high intent retention about this. So you constantly. How long would you say? Very interesting. How long? Oh, sorry. An audience. How long would you say a video That's should be? Like around oh, how long minutes? Oh. This earphones kind of have a problem. Oh, sorry. Can, can you hear me? Hello, hello. Hello? Can you hear me? <laughs> can you, I, I hear you fine. Oh, yes, I hear you. I hear you. Sorry, it was about oh, the oh. earphones. Yeah, I don't have so much time, but you have so much female. <laughs> yeah. This means you have to keep doing makeup, makeup vlog, diet vlog, mm -hmm. 
more specifically, you can do it so much better than this. Like um, a lot of different diet, um, a lot of different like tips and like vlogs. And okay. you have to have like your featured aspect to your own self, like on the thumbnails as well. Yeah. Uh, I have I just have one question. Yeah. Um from your experience, mm -hmm. how long do you think a video should be? Because people like exit pretty pretty like from right. the start. Right. So if you want to monetize a lot, like if you want to get more profits out of it, it should be at least eight minutes. But if it's mm. just talking about it's just if it's just like a talk or like a um interaction not a vlog if you're just talking out there or a reaction i i think it can be less than five minutes so it can just like yeah. be normal and set it less than five minutes. yeah oh, wow. but from eight minutes you can put mid scroll the mid scroll advertisements it used mm. to be 10 minutes but it got it got changed to eight minutes so if you want to make a vlog i i recommend eight minutes eight to ten oh. minutes yeah, Thank people you. are gonna exit anyway, so yes. <laughs> don't need to worry. <laughs> All right, okay. so yeah, I need to get back to other people as well. I can't really go through everything, but still, I hope it was helpful. And I'm gonna be checking on your channel constantly. If you have any questions, please DM me on Instagram. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can give you more feedbacks on it. Okay. All right, Thank perfect. You. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm so familiar with you. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> I know you last time. I, I know you from last time and I saw a lot of videos of yours. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Do you have any difficulties or any questions to start off? And you can introduce yourself too. Uh, well, <laughs> hi, my name is Kaz. Yeah. I'm yeah. from Mexico mm -hmm. and I like people. <laughs> You like people? But, yes. Oh wow! Wow. Yes, uh, and I, I'm, I've, I've been a fan of yours, mm -hmm. Korean bro. Mm. I watch all your videos. Oh wow! <laughs> yes. Thank you. I'm a little bit nervous. That's yeah. why. Mm. Oh, okay. What contents do you want to make? I don't know what kind of you're doing, but. What kind of um, YouTuber do you want to do? Do you want to be? I want to be like a K-pop content creator, mm. like reactions mm -hmm. and maybe covers, mm -hmm. and like makeup. I like makeup a lot. Mm -hmm. So and that those videos have more views. Mm, so I that's want true. To do that. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, so what I thought about your channel, uh, what was the name? Cassie Cute. <laughs> Cassie Cute, yeah. Okay. So you got already 10,000. As I already said before in the lecture, like it's really important to have sections. Mm -hmm. Yeah, put popular uploads. Put popular uploads, mm -hmm. and because popular uploads usually like give more. You know, this is my this is a makeup artist channel. Popular uploads mm -hmm. give more, like, oh, 
Oh, I don't know what I'm Oh, wait, what is it? I was showing you. I'm going to be sharing this. Yes, yeah. Share. Do you see it? Yeah. Okay, so this one is a very, very, it's a very popular uh, makeup artist channel. Mm -hmm. And if you see popular notes, you probably want to see it too. Like, other than this one, mm -hmm. you see it? Like, it's so neat. Don't you think, do you want to watch it? Like, don't I can't it? see it. <laughs> you can't see it? No, I can see only your channel. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Does it work? Is it working now? Yes. Uh -huh. Do you see? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So if you see the popular popular uploads, it's really eye-catching, right? Full coverage, mm -hmm. don't and do. I, I, I really want to know what do's and do. Like, you know, people feel the same way and people have the same similar feelings. So put your channel... That's so cute. Uh, put your channel like uh, have divide sections and also what I thought about this one. Mm -hmm. Like this is a really good content. This is a really good topic. But compared to your subscriber number, like you're getting mm -hmm. really low views, which means um, you didn't catch their their eyes. You mm -hmm. didn't make them click on it within forty eight hours so people like people aren't aren't getting any suggestions from your channel which is kind of sad but you can just yeah. completely change it because you already have really good amount of um, subscribers mm -hmm. actually when I clicked on it I was so surprised because of the high quality oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah like really high quality like you even have like background oh, and like you have like your decorations are so pretty. That's really perfect for makeup contents. Mm -hmm. But what I thought is that, um, like compared to your real high quality, the thumbnail doesn't support that. You know. Mm -hmm. So if I ever make a thumbnail, I would make it like. Okay, like this, like this, like this. Mm -hmm. And K-pop idol makeup versus traditional Korean. Um, this is good too, but I'll probably want to do like, because you're emphasizing like eye makeup, right? Mm -hmm. How to do easy like Korean eye, eye makeup like idol, like copying idol. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And like if you see this kind of videos, it's so obvious, right? Mm -hmm. The comparison is so, so, so obvious. So if I see this, I don't know the difference. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you have to be very, very like mm, obvious on the YouTube channel. And also there's so, like, there's so much information out there, mm -hmm. which means I know you're passionate, but like, I don't know which one to click on. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not easy to choose. Oh, I, like, this is good. This one is a good example for a thumbnail. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like this more one. More simple. Yeah, more simple. Mm -hmm. uh, less words. Mm -hmm. And let's watch your popular modes. BTS, Blackpink. Reaction. <laughs> yeah, it's actually like not focusing on yourself, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, people find it fun because people watch it, but I want you to focus on yourself more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or or the other way around, if it's too hard for yourself to be like just featuring yourself only, then make your title very, very powerful. Mm. like this then it's gonna be not your own channel it's just like something reaction channel you know 
yeah you have to just like think about it like should i be the main character or is it okay to be reaction channel you know mm -hmm. mm. Mm. is there any more questions mm. do you want me to go on to your youtube um studio and yes. analyze oh yeah okay let's do that so your videos are actually really fun and high quality. Like you should always keep keep that in mind. And I'm gonna request a remote. Is it working? I think so. Can you move it? Um, no. No? Oh. You haven't done it. I don't know what is happening. You can control it. Can it says I can control your screen, but it doesn't. <laughs> It's kind of weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Keep up then. This is kind of weird. <laughs> yeah. mm. I request that again. Oh, wait. Something. Oh, oh, yes. yes, yes, yeah, it's working. <laughs> okay, oh, can you move? Is it working? Yeah, oh, yeah, okay, That's working. full screen. Okay. I can't click on anything though. Oh, oh okay. Mm. It's weird. <laughs> it was working before. Search on search on button. It's setting different things. I think. Mm. Now can you move it? Uh, let me try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go into your videos. Okay, let's see popular modes and then see the analysis. Um. Maybe. Is it? Is it can I, how can okay? I see the? How can I see the full screen? Like until here? I don't. I see on, only here until. Mm. You. Mm. Oh, for my video. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll just go on. It doesn't. Okay. <laughs> I, I think it's a MacBook, right? Yes. Yeah, I think that's why it's like not really like interacting well. Right Anyways, so I'll just go on. Okay, so what's your most popular video? It's a BTS reaction. BTS reaction? Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Quite. Views. Um, Let's see, views. 
Is that this one? one is good. Right? Yeah. Okay, let's see the analysis of these. It was from a long time ago. Oh. <laughs> so actually, people searched it. If you see this, people searched mm -hmm. it. Not bro it didn't pop up. They searched it. They wrote it down. So this is not a good example of like being trending videos mm -hmm. because people search it means it has some type of like really like good information like that time it was a hot keyword or something mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but our goal is to make them suggested mm -hmm. to other people so that means you're gonna have your own content like this means you lack of your own um, characters mm -hmm. like because people found it like with their own like thinking you know it mm -hmm. didn't pop up right mm -hmm. so let's see reach it probably reached a lot I'm guessing let's see it's a long time ago so well, how long ago is it it's 2017 27 <laughs> You see, impression is like 4 million. It popped up for 4 million. Not like, it reached a lot of people. But it didn't make 1 million views, right? Mm. So it lacked of um, thumbnail clickbait a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then it lacked of a character of yourself. Because this could lead to a lot of like um, benefits of your own channel. This mm -hmm. could have been really, really popular if God like really uh, if you see the potential here okay engagement it was like really high but then it's like low 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 mm -hmm. people are not engaging in this video anymore right mm -hmm. and you average have like 30, three minutes and they exit right so make it longer my video is usually like four or five minutes because it's me like it's focusing on me so if they already clicked on it people want to see me itself so it has more values but this kind of videos if it's just reaction it's hard to have more longer retention for audience mm -hmm. yeah and also um channel average is 1991 but this one is fine because um it's really so much better if it's uh, more than 90 Mm -hmm. Oh, if oh, it got disconnected. No, <laughs> it's okay. Oh, no. It's, it's okay. Yeah, and can you go on audience? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, yes, you can control it. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why, why it's going back and forth. <laughs> so, if you see audience, you have so much female and. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of young people. You even have a lot of 13 to 17. Mm -hmm. If you increase this more, I think it's going to be better. Like, um, we're interested in, like, not just about reaction. Do some um, stuff that is, that is, like, more, like, mm, this is all about, like, high teens, to be honest like mm -hmm. reaction and those kind of stuff so people will be interested if you keep doing like your own like facial expression and your activities and like you know mm -hmm. people don't know the owner of the channel that's why it yeah. just doesn't really increase oh mm -hmm. uh, the trend yeah that's really sad but like you have to make yourself out there put there mm -hmm. more and like find a clickbait which is not negative like more mm. powerful and impact, right? Yeah, mm. I think that's more good. Mm. And Mexica, Mexican people watch a lot. So uh, put it more like Mexican and Korean. Mexico versus what? Like Mexican alcohol, what? Like those kind mm. of things, you know? Like mm. use your nationality a lot. And like those kind of people um, speak Spanish, all, all these, right? All these countries. Mm -hmm. So do a lot of Spanish related and Korean related, like find out the culture differences. Yeah.
if you have any more questions, I can't really talk more right now. Mm -hmm. But if you have any questions, please DM me. I can like give you more feedback and like if you just think like what do you think about this thumbnail that I can help you out with that. Oh, cool. Yeah, I'm a viewer as well. I'm a I'm a like subscriber to a lot of different channels too. So like if you just think about yourself, like would I click this? You know? Yeah. That'll be really uh, helpful for making your own content. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think that's it for now. <laughs> yeah. If you have any questions, like please let me know. I would uh -huh. really like to help you. Yeah. yeah. And you can yeah. yeah, you you are a really good influencer. Keep doing Oh, thank you. Yeah. You too. I'm thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. All right. See you. Thank you. Bye. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. I can't see you right now, though. Oh, hi. I, okay. Hi. I honestly took a look of your channel. Okay. All right, so I'm going to go into your channel first. So could you introduce yourself first? Um, hi, my name is Katrina, and mm -hmm. I am from the Philippines, which hi, I know Bobo you hi. love. <laughs> really? Yes, oh, I wow. am uh, recommended with your content in my channel. Oh, wow. <laughs> and um, and um, I enjoy Korean culture and mm -hmm. uh, comparing it to my country as well. Mm. Oh, wow, that's amazing. <laughs> you, were, you did differences and similarities. This is actually a really good wording, actually, you know. And is this you? Which one? Oh, you can't see it? Yeah. Um, um, share. This one. Do you see it now? Yeah. yeah. Do you see me and page two? Mm, yeah. Okay, perfect. And, uh, I actually love your, um, I love your, um, what do you call this, banner? Oh. Like, this is so cute. Like, it's eye-catching. Oh, what you. I think, mm, oh, let's see your popular names. Can I watch it? Yeah, I sure. <laughs> So cute. But it has a copyright, right? It yeah, got it got blocked uh, because of the copyright. copyright. <laughs> so this one has a problem. Okay, for me, it's really cute and like really diverse. You have like really a variety of different contents and topics, but it doesn't have one thing that keeps people. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's also so, uh, mm -hmm. negative. It's both positive and negative. Yeah, yeah, and both positive and negative. If you think about it, like, Tokyo, Korea, like, this is the second popular video, right? But yes, it's this for is a not competition. A uh, competition, yes. yeah. But, like, this doesn't show what you're gonna do like this you, you're really good at naming things like filipino speaking korean only like you should do a lot of challenges i think and also you don't need this kind of parenthesis and title like people have no clue <laughs> and it takes up a lot of space in the title yeah. Yeah. i also have a problem with that like uh, i have so much to add uh, in my but with that, but I I already took mm. note of it a while yeah. ago when in the workshop. Mm -hmm. It's a so nice like, comment. Yeah, this one is really good. This thumbnail. Like, but I want you to have your face too. Or like, if you want to do this kind of series, you can do it with different foods. Only food. Street mm -hmm. food, like, you know, home food, handmade food. Like, 
Korean burgers, Korean stuff, and like you know, only like this serious. Make you can make it as serious, but like um, just by just by looking at this web page, this this home, I can't tell what you're trying to do, honestly. So that's why you make a lot of videos and like do a lot of stuff. It doesn't really attract one target. So you should have your own target. Are you moving? Hello, hello. Oh, oh you're not moving. <laughs> you stuck it there. Sorry. Oh, hello. Um, wait. Um, I'm, I, I'm actually uh, trying to focus on a playlist that I am doing, which is um, more on, uh, you can, uh, try clicking on my playlist. playlist. Yeah, this is actually it, really good. It's yeah. the yeah, it's more on contents like vlog and challenges, like what you said a while ago. Exactly. And, uh, well, yeah, this has so, too many sections. I think you can you maybe mean? like um Korean games. Here. Like it started with okay. Like I don't know what it means by it. You know what I mean. So why, the reason why I make playlists is because I do like Filipino music cover, right? Mm. Then people want to see, oh, what did she cover other than this one as well? So that's why people don't need to like look all the way, scroll through. So you make it one category so people can watch it. The other videos, like similar videos. But this one is maybe, this is not so similar for me. Like. Like this is all like it's one category for me. <laughs> like it's not something really like differentiated. You know what I mean? Maybe you can do reaction videos. Mokbang videos. Hello, you're not working as well again. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Oh yeah. So if I were you, I'll probably go for K-pop reaction, K-food reaction, K-beauty reaction, vlog. It's like this is too complicated. I don't even know like K cycle games. Like this all goes just vlogs, or you can, um, this is not eating or anything. So K-beauty probably, you know k Norebang? This is reaction again, or like vlog. So make it a little simple. And this is, this is like, um, yeah, the title is the big problem. Title doesn't attract one target. So are you targeting Filipinos or Koreans? As far as um, I look up in my channel analytics, uh, it's more on Filipinos and then- More second, Filipinos, right? Yes, and the second uh, target is Koreans because of the oh. SAC 3 uh, dance challenge that ah. I did. <laughs> so well, I kind of uh, relate to your uh, 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 comment a while ago when you said uh, uh, more content that uh, doesn't require more effort are the ones yeah, yeah. going viral. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So to be honest, having a one target is more important for now for your videos because it doesn't have any target for my point of view. It doesn't have a target. It's just like, it just, um, the reason why is that the, the, this one has to be viral because it's your channel, it's your characteristics, and it's your thoughts. But this one got viral is kind of weird for an influencer unless you're a, like a TikToker or something. Like if you keep doing like keep TikToking, then it's fine. If you're gonna do, if you're gonna make it as serious and not monetized. But um, this is not the owner of this channel. You know what I mean? You should be the owner of the channel, but this is like, Saksuri is the channel, is, is the owner of this right now. The song itself is more trending than yourself in this yourself has to be more powerful you know what i mean so i think the title this is too complicated too complicated 
this is better. Filipino tries. Filipino tries. Saksuri dance. You know, that kind of like uh, catchy and like eye, eye catching titles would be recommended. And also, this is good. Differences and similarities between Filipino and Korea. And but on the thumbnail, it's just pretty. It doesn't show like you're gonna actually talk about information. You can actually like give a lot of different things. Like if I ever do like Filipino and Korean culture, where is he? Um, Filipino, Korean, culture differences, if you wanna deal with it. Oh, Jessica is my friend. This, you know, like really I also big, like yeah, like really big difference has to be <laughs> on the thumbnail, you know, like this. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like, if you wanna talk about like comparison, like you have to be more like. Uh, I think this is just pretty. Yeah. And you are using the same name, actually. You already put it twice. Difference is similar is between Philippines and Korea, right? You take you took up a lot of space for this, and I love the design. And it's really pretty, but like when they just watch it, they decided three seconds. Oh, am I gonna click on it? No, nope, pass, pass, pass. You know, decided really quick time. So if you wanna be like eye catching, you have to see different people's thumbnail like uh, let's go on for example Haley Kim I personally just subscribed to her let's go on to Haley Kim oh or Jolie Jolie let's do Jolie Jolie compares a lot of British thing and Korean things right if you see it, it's so obvious, right? Yeah, you should learn from like really big YouTubers um, thumbnail and how they title their videos. Do you want me to go on your YouTube studio? So analyze it? Sure. Yeah. I should, I should screen share my Or I can just go on to... I can share. Okay. Or I can share. You can you can just like um, change your share monitor so I can see it. Is this fine? Oh yes, that works. Okay, so I'm gonna ask request control. Is it working? Mm, I already approved. Okay. Mm. okay, I'm going to try again. to start okay it's working right yeah. okay perfect all right let's see let's find out the difficulties all right so let's go on to your most popular video which was Saksuri dancing video, right? Um, Where is it? <laughs> okay, I'll just end up here. Oh, doesn't work.
Where is it? Did I miss it? Around July, I think. Ah, oh no. Again. This one? This one? Uh, ah, this below. one. Oh, this got monetized? <laughs> Oh, you haven't been monetized. Oh, yeah. Right. Okay, so. Okay, let's go on to analytics. The most popular video. 18 seconds. Okay, this is a really big problem. Direct or unknown is the source, right? But usually, if you're an influencer, if you're a YouTuber, it should pop up on their search or channel pages or browse features. These are the good things that um, that your videos are trending or popping up for other YouTube channels. But this one, direct or unknown, is 68.4. Is that just random people just watch it. That's why it's just got 4,000 views, honestly speaking. So that's why um, it doesn't really have a power. It just got randomly popular. Because it was uh, relevant, I think. At yeah, that it's time. yeah. Let's see, reach. How many people reached it? And actually, you have really um, thirty-five thousand people reached it. Uh, yeah, it's not bad. It's actually good, but unknown is too high. <laughs> yeah, too high. Like if I go onto my YouTube, it's always like always YouTube suggested video browse features channel pages yeah unknown can't be that high because people can't really find me like randomly you know? engagement so um people people started from here and then very low here from here people exited probably around here and then it got gone and audience, let's see audience. Okay, this one, a lot of 35 to 44 people watched it, which means it doesn't fit your contents, right? Yeah, so people watched it not because of the contents itself, it just had a trend and randomly picked. So you can tell this one is not something that you continue. Like if you want to be just on like popular on among like among um, just random people, then you can. But it's kind of uh, not constant. And also, a lot of South Korean people watching it. Do you speak Korean? Um, I speak. I Ah. How I learned Korean, you know. What I really love with Korea. Well, uh, Filipino street, street food, Korean street food versus my own. But um, if you want to make. Oh, Philippine people are not You have a lot of South Korean people. But just because of this. I think, yeah, just because of this video. Let's go into the whole analytics so we can do better. Okay. Engage my audience. Okay. Now we're, okay, now, you see? Not many Korean people are watching it usually Filipino, so you should target Filipinos. Yeah. So much better than Koreans. Yeah. Philippine, good. Philippine versus Korean, you don't, you know, there are so many food or like tongue twister, something challenge or Philippine diet, Korean diet, um, celebrities, you don't go, like those kind of things. And you are, you have, 100% female. So you should focus on those kind of things that are like female friendly, right? Yeah. So, yeah, this kind of female. Mm -hmm. 
So I hope you make more videos about like culture differences. And because you can speak Korean, you should constantly like emphasize what you have, you know, what you can talk about more than other Filipinos. Mm. And you can, you know the trend because you know Suck City. So I think um, do some trendy stuff as well. Yeah, that's it. If you, if you DM me, I'm willing to help you. So yeah, give me any, like send me any questions. I'll try to ask. I will send you uh, more playlists about Filipino music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Perfect, thank you. Did you ever watch OPM? <laughs> yes. ah, that's Especially so when you uh you said wish one was seven points. Ah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. Keep it on really? like um you can just constantly put yourself out there and like find out your own values that other people can't. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if you have any questions, I'll try to answer your game. All right, Thank perfect. You so much. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Have a nice day. <laughs>